The resource area is your electronic filing cabinet within Schoology where you can store items that you're likely to use repeatedly in your courses. You can access your personal resources using the resources link in the purple banner across the top. Choose My Resources. If you've synced your Google Apps account, you'll see it listed in your resources. You will probably want to create collections and folders to organize your resources. One of the main differences between folders and collections is that you can share your collections with others, but not your folders. However, if you put a folder inside a collection and share that collection, the collection and all the folders within it will be viewable by those you shared with. To create a collection, use the Add Collections button. Name the collection and choose Create. The collection will appear under your My Resources listing. To create a folder within a collection, use the Add Resources button. You will see this Add Resources button whether you are in a collection, a folder, or on your home screen. And you can use this feature to upload files directly from your computer or add any of the other content types we've already talked about in this course. Typically, you will create content in your course and then want to save a copy of it in your resources. To do this, navigate to your course, locate the item, and use the gear box next to it to save a copy to your resources. Your home collection is the only collection that cannot be shared with others. To share any of your other collections, click on the name of the collection in your My Resources and choose the Share button. Search for others and add them. Your collection will appear to those you shared with in a Shared by Others section of their resources. You can also adjust the person's permissions by going back to Sharing and looking for the Permissions tab. View Only allows others to view the collection's contents, add the item to one of their courses, or make a copy of the item for their personal resources. Editing Rights add the ability to edit the title, move the item out of your collection and delete the items. Plus, editing enables other members to add new items to the collection. If you want to create a collection that everyone can add to but you're worried about giving others editing rights, you can also use the resources feature within groups to share items. The drop-down menu that appears when you hover next to a collection's name allows you to rename or delete the collection. And you'll notice a gear icon to the right of every resource in your My Resources. This gear icon allows you to edit, move, copy, or delete. The edit option allows you to change the title of your resource as well as to add notes here that will only appear in your resources. You can't edit the actual item's content here. Add to course allows you to add this resource to a course. Copy to allows you to copy and paste the resource into another location in your resources while keeping the original copy here. In contrast, Move To is a cut and paste that actually removes the item from this area of the resources and puts it into another location. When you want to move an item, use the drop down menu to select whether you want this item moved to a new collection or to a folder. And Delete allows you to delete the resource completely. These options are also located in the Edit button. This button only appears when you select a checkbox, and selecting multiple checkboxes allows for bulk action. You will find more tools to organize your resources within the Options drop-down menu. These options allow you to reorder and rearrange your resources. If you select Reorder, arrows appear next to each resource. Click on the arrow and drag the item to the desired new location. Choose Submit for that reordering to take effect. Auto Arrange will arrange all of your items in your collection or folder alphabetically. Take a moment to visit your My Resources and experiment with different options like adding, moving, copying, sharing, and rearranging your resources.